Hello and welcome to my video. In this video I want to show you how to get a factory image for your Google Pixel device. You need a Google Pixel device and your bootloader has to be unlocked un unless it won't work. Click on the top left corner if you haven't unlocked your bootloader right now and you want to do that. Okay, let's continue. Now you need the factory image or the ROM that you need for your Google Pixel device. I go to the official Google website and the link is also in the description. You scroll down. For me it's a sale feature, it's a Google Pixel device and you download your version that you need. In my case it's a European version, I live in Europe and you click on the link, you download it and you need another file. This is also in the description. It's the ADB and fastboot drivers that you need. You just scroll down a little bit and you just download here the portable version if you want to. After you've done that, I copy this for myself into a new folder. Here. Now I have the fastboot file or folder and you have the selfish folder right here. Okay, now you extract both of them. Just wait a little bit. In the meantime, you use your Google Pixel device and go into fast boot mode. What you have to do is you press the power button, shut it down. After you shut down the device, press the power button and the volume down button together for about five seconds and then you will see this right here. I hope you can see that clearly. And what you should see is also that right here on the bottom of this. You should see that. Wait a second. That should stand right on, on the bottom. Bootloader unlocked. I don't know if you can see this, but there it stands, bootloader unlocked. You need to have an unlocked bootloader unless it won't work. Okay, You have your device right here at the bootloader and plug it in here. And your Windows PC will automatically install the fastboot driver that you need for your device to work. Okay, go to the other folder and extract it too. Now. You copy all the files in this folder and copy into the Sailfish folder. And what we have to do right now is you just open the Flash All Bed. And that's it, I guess. Okay, your device is now finished. And we reboot itself. You see the unlock bootloader on the bottom of it. Wait a second. Here on the bottom you can see the unlock bootloader. And now it should be good to go. Ah, you can see it. Ah. So this was it for my tutorial. And I hope it works for you. You can leave a comment down below if it worked or not. Give this video a thumbs up and we, I will see you in the next video. Bye.